Soper and sports with Jim Berry. Three, two, one, zero, and liftoff. Liftoff. Americans return to space as Discovery clears the tower. Good evening. America is back in space tonight. It is the triumph of Discovery, two and a half years after the Challenger ended in disaster. There are many South Florida residents who, in one way or another, contribute to the shuttle's success. Channel 7's Rick Chambers reports tonight on two of the people who have been monitoring the flight closely. As the Discovery crew circles the Earth, they have a bit of Fort Lauderdale with them. This is ACR Electronics, and these workers are testing a handheld two-way radio, just like the ones the astronauts are carrying in space. ACR has had uh, items and products on every shuttle mission. Morton Sunshine is an engineer with ACR. He suffered through the Challenger drama, but is elated with discovery. Oh, it's very exciting to be part of the shuttle mission. It's um, something you do and you think about it when you go home and you're proud that you did something. It's something you can tell your friends and your family. While millions of Americans are using their eyes to watch the shuttle's journey on television, a gentleman here in Kendall is acting as the ears for thousands of others. For the past six years, John Sims has been a ham operator and an amateur astronomer. He was monitoring NASA's conversations with Challenger when the shuttle exploded and has been listening intently to today's talks with Discovery. What was it like this morning then, comparing today to two and a half years ago? Very exciting. You know, every, everybody was real tense. You could, you could feel it in the air. You know, I'm, I'm just glad it went off without a hitch. From his brother-in-law's ham shack, Sims has been broadcasting the NASA signal to other hams in South Florida. And late tonight came a bit of chatter that makes it all worthwhile. Good to be back on the air again after uh, two and a half years. This is wa 3 nan setting down for the evening with our uh, Space Shuttle Air to Ground Communications. Shuttle Flight uh, 26, Space Shuttle Discovery, wa 3 nan clear. In Kendall, Rick Chambers, Channel 7 News, tonight. And that shuttle crew is going to start talking again at 5 in the morning, just in case you'd like to listen in. <laughs> but we'll have more on Discovery still to come.